Gibbs Bisky. This one-of-a-kind amphibious vehicle, known as the Gibbs Bisky, can perform the duties of both a motorcycle and a jet ski concurrently. Because it is a single-seater vehicle that is powered by a twin jet, it is the first of its kind in many different ways around the world. With dimensions of just 2.3 meters in length and less than one meter in width, the Bisky is the smallest of all the Gibbs high-speed amphibious platforms possible. It offers a maximum power output of 55 horsepower and is powered by a gasoline engine that has two cylinders. On land, it is capable of reaching speeds of up to 80 miles per hour, while on water, it is capable of reaching speeds of 37 miles per hour. Over the course of less than five seconds, the transformation from land to water takes place. Not only can the Bisky provide a significant amount of fun, but it also symbolizes genuine independence for the person. Watercar Panther ProDrive. It is a one-of-a-kind automobile that combines the capabilities of a car and a boat, and it is called the Watercar Panther ProDrive. It is an off-roading convertible powerboat that is compatible with street use. The Panther is a product of Watercar, a corporation that was established in the state of California. This vehicle is propelled by a Honda V6 engine that is 3.7 liters in capacity and has the ability to achieve speeds of up to 70 to 80 miles per hour on land and 44 miles per hour on water. Therefore, it is the only amphibious vehicle in the world that is capable of towing a water skier at a speed that is sufficient. In spite of the fact that it possesses remarkable capabilities, it is reported to be somewhat difficult to operate on land. There is a price tag of $198 for the Panther. The engineering and racing team from the United Kingdom known as ProDrive has made certain improvements to this particular vehicle. Gibbs Quadski. One of the most cutting edge amphibious vehicles on the market is the Gibbs Quadski, which is a hybrid of a personal watercraft and a quad bike. The four-stroke Amphiquad, which was introduced by Gibbs Sports Amphibians in October 2012, is a vehicle that can be converted from a quad bike to a personal watercraft in a seamless manner. In land conditions, it operates in the same manner as a typical all-terrain vehicle, but when a button is pressed, the wheels retract and power is transferred from the rear differential to a propeller. A maximum speed of 72 kilometers per hour is attainable on both land and water. Through the utilization of a marine jet propulsion system and wheel retraction, the Quadski is able to easily shift between land and water environments. It is propelled by a marine-specific variant of the 1.3-liter engine that BMW Motorrad used in the K1300S sports bike. The production of the car came to an end in 2016. Stabix 250UC the revolutionary amphibious boat model, known as the Stabex 250UC, is built for multi-use activities, making it ideal for on-water camping, fishing, or family vacations. A full-width cabin and a length of 25 feet make it an ideal vehicle for transporting passengers because it offers enough space. A cutting-edge technology known as Anura Amphibious is utilized by the vessel. There is a full galley seating package with bespoke diamond stitching, a V-berth with seating backrests, fold-down extensions and squabs, floodlighting in the cabin and cockpit, and a fold-out table. These are some of the key features. In addition to that, it has a maximum horsepower of 450 along with a gasoline tank capacity of 300 liters. The Stabex 250UC is a product that exemplifies the brand's dedication to quality and innovation. It provides a one-of-a-kind combination of comfort, performance, and versatility. ATV Shaman. A Russian-made 8x8 all-terrain vehicle, the Avtoros Shaman has a wide range of capabilities. It is able to cross a wide range of terrains, including marshes, tundra, and even bodies of water, thanks to its low-pressure tires and a diesel engine that generates power from four cylinders. There are three different driving modes available for the Shaman, which can accommodate up to eight passengers. This one-of-a-kind design features a driving posture that is reminiscent of a captain's chair, as well as an original closed frame that protects the components of the transmission. The Shaman is an excellent vehicle for off-roading and other types of outdoor excursions. 
Regarding the cost, it is subject to change based on the setup as well as any additional options that are selected. It is possible that the total cost might reach up to $240,000, with the base price beginning at approximately $200,000 overall. Sealegs Hydrosol RIB At 9 meters in length, the Sealegs Hydrosol RIB is the largest amphibious rib that Sealegs has ever manufactured. For everyone who is looking for a large platform for their excursions, this is a dream come true. The length of this vessel is somewhat more than 9 meters, which allows for a substantial amount of space in front of the console, along the tubes, and behind the crew sitting. A dive boat, a fishing boat, or a boat for a family outing are all excellent uses for this vessel. The boat makes use of the most recent advancements in amphibious hydrosol technology, which allow it to optimize the center of gravity of the vehicle and improve its performance while on the water. Up to 12 people can be accommodated in it, a 40 horsepower on-land engine and a 425 horsepower outboard engine are both included in the boat's equipment. Additionally, it has a fuel capacity of 250 liters in all-terrain tires that are 26 inches in diameter. Sherp ATV Rugged and built for tough terrain, the Sherp ATV can handle any obstacle you throw at it. Businesses benefit from it, and individuals can enjoy it as a form of pleasure. Two versions are available, the Sherp N and the Sherp Pro. With a starting price of $115,000, the Sherp Pro is a popular choice for frigid climates, such as the oil fields in Canada. At $126,000, you may own the Sherp N. An astounding $375,000 is required to purchase the larger and more capable Sherp Arc. Model, customization, and local demand all play a role in the final price. Extra expenses include transport trailers and amphibious response trailers, which cost around $8,000 apiece for large-scale disaster response. Optional extras include things like fuel tanks for the wheels. All of these prices are listed in US dollars. The off-road capabilities of the Sherp ATV are second to none, making it ideal for both work and play. Sealegi's 12RC a revolutionary amphibious vessel, the Sealegs 12RC is reshaping the large size amphibious class. It can run on up to two 400 horsepower outboards and has a total length of 12 meters. The 12RC has a payload capacity that is three times greater than that of conventional offerings. Massive tires measuring 940 millimeters in diameter and 500 millimeters in width enhance its 7,500 kilograms gross weight electric sunroofs on both sides, sliding windows at the back of the cabin, and a variety of layout choices, including a kitchen, up to four beds, a bathroom, and business seating, are all standard features of this vessel. It has superior drive-by-wire throttle controls and electric steering system that works in tandem with them, and docking and positioning capabilities via the Helmmaster joystick. Among amphibious vessels, the Sealegs 12RC stands head and shoulders above the competition in terms of independence, comfort and elegance. Amphibibus Amphibious transport vehicles. BV, located in Nijmegen, the Netherlands, is responsible for the development and construction of the Amphibus, an innovative amphibious bus. It is a versatile means of transportation because it is built to function on both land and water. There was some thought given to the possibility of replacing the Renfrew ferry that across the River Clyde with the Amphibus. In Rotterdam Harbour, where it was put through its paces by splash tours, it was able to take the wash from tugs and cargo ships without any problems. With a chassis derived from Volvo, the vehicle is capable of reaching speeds of 60 miles per hour on land and 6.5 knots and 7.5 miles per hour on water. The Amphibus was not chosen to continue the Renfrew ferry service, despite the substantial capabilities it possesses. The tourist cruise services that go directly from Schiphol Airport to the canals in Amsterdam. Guana Commuter the high-tech yacht tender known as the Iguana Commuter is meant to provide experiences that are both smooth and dry. This vehicle is equipped with a convertible hardtop that, at the push of a button, can be converted into a completely weatherproof captain's seat. 
Iguana owners and guests are able to enjoy the Iguana experience throughout the day thanks to the snug cabin that features an integrated head. In addition to being able to smoothly and dryly travel over turbulent seas, it is also able to venture on practically any terrain with ease and safety. In order to ensure the safety and convenience of passengers, as well as to enhance the level of security, the commuter is fitted with a wide electric ladder. In addition to that, it comes equipped with an electronic anchor that can be deployed at the push of a button to the precise length that is required, due to the fact that the Iguana Land Drive is capable of traversing nearly any terrain. Geo Rescue ATV the Geo Rescue ATV is an off-road vehicle that is designed to operate in any environment, regardless of the terrain or the weather. Because it is outfitted with off-road solutions that were taken from racing, it is an all-terrain vehicle that is both powerful and responsive. Even though it looks like a truck, it has the capacity to transport up to 11 people. There are 5,200 measurements, and it weights 3.2 tons. A number of different extras, such as low-pressure wheels that provide improved flotation on water or snow, a water tank that holds 620 litres, and a heavy-duty gearbox that has axles that can be locked, are all available for customization. Both gasoline, with 340 to 500 horsepower, and diesel, 218 horsepower or 304 horsepower, are available as engine choices. The GEO Rescue has a starting price of 85,000 euros. However, it has been reported that it can cost as much as $160,000. Burlak Amphibious ATV Designed for tough off-road conditions, the Burlak Amphibious ATV is a strong six-wheeled vehicle. Within its operational temperature range of minus 60 to plus 50 degrees Celsius, it can navigate difficult terrains as sand, swamps, rivers, and snow. Due to its adaptability, the Burlak has been successfully trialed in extreme climates like as Antarctica and the Arctic. With its 150 horsepower engine, this ATV can cruise at 50 kilometers per hour. This versatile vehicle is ideal for a wide range of trips and everyday uses because to its impressive payload capability of up to three tons, the amphibious qualities of the Burlak are enhanced by its design which has extremely low pressure tires. These tires enable the vehicle to effortlessly traverse water impediments. The base pricing for the Burlak 6x6 model is $180,000. The high cost is a reflection of the vehicle's high level of engineering and the versatility it offers to users in harsh environments. Sea Lion Amphibious Car with its one-of-a-kind design, the Sea Lion prototype is a vehicle that has the potential to break world records on both land and sea. The vehicle in question is an amphibious world speed record competition vehicle, contrary to the conventional definition of an automobile. Sea Lions are capable of reaching speeds of up to 125 miles per hour when they are driven on public roads. But it really shines when it's off-road, where it can achieve speeds of up to 60 miles per hour on water. A Mazda 13B rotary engine was installed in the vehicle, which was built out of aluminum that had been TIG welded together. As stated by its designer, Mark Witt, the vehicle has the ability to achieve a top speed of 180 miles per hour on land if it is equipped with an improved engine and the appropriate handling. An example of human innovation and the quest of speed in any environment, the sea lion is a remarkable animal. Gibbs Aquada. Gibbs Sports Amphibians is responsible for the development of the ultra-fast amphibious vehicle known as the Gibbs Aquada. With a top speed of nearly 100 miles per hour on land and over 30 miles per hour on water, it is the first high-speed amphibian in the world. The Aquada was developed from the ground up to operate exceptionally well on both land and water, and it has been granted over 60 patents that cover various technological breakthroughs. As a result of its 2.5-liter Rover V6 engine, the Aquada is capable of reaching speeds of up to 100 miles per hour and can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in a time span of less than 10 seconds. Not only does the Aquada offer a wonderful experience, but it also gives passengers the opportunity to go in ways that were previously impossible. During the years 2003 and 2004, 
It was a concept car that was constructed in limited quantities. Gibbs Amphitruck. In addition to being referred to as the Humdinga, the Gibbs Amphitruck is a one-of-a-kind vehicle that is able to function on both land and water. The car is equipped with four-wheel drive and is driven by a supercharged V8 gasoline engine that produces 350 horsepower. On land, it is capable of reaching freeway speeds, while on water, it can go faster than 30 miles per hour. There is a very brief period of time required for the shift from land to water. The length of the Amphitruck is 7 meters, and it is available in both 3-seater and 6-seater variants. It is particularly useful in circumstances involving first responders, where the ability to respond quickly might be of critical importance, and it is equally suitable for personal or commercial use. The Amphitruck is a flexible vehicle that may be used for a variety of purposes, including rescue, utility, and leisure activities, thanks to its robust off-road and on-water capabilities.